In today's episode, we present how a lumbar disc herniation operation is performed. If you clicked on this video then you are most likely suffering from a lumbar disc herniation and your doctor has recommended an operation. So it is very important that you understand this operation and how it is done. A herniated disc is a fragment of the disc nucleus that is pushed out of the annulus into the spinal canal by a tear or rupture in the annulus and puts pressure on the nerve roots, causing radiating pain into the legs. To solve this problem, we have to remove the herniated fragment and release the nerve root, so the pain disappears. During the operation, the patient is positioned in the prone position. An X-ray device is used to identify the right segment. To reach the herniated fragment, a skin incision is made, and the spinal muscles are attracted to the side. Now a small part of the vertebral arch is removed by using a drill to expose the dura, which is colored yellow here. The dura is mobilized with a retractor towards the center of the spinal canal to expose the herniated fragment. The herniated fragment is then removed with grasping forceps to release the nerves. In this way, the nerves are released. The pain disappears and the goal of the operation is achieved. If you still have questions about this operation, please contact us.